change for the better. Mahatma Gandhi once said, be the change you want to see in the world. This is exactly what these three people have done. The changes they made took their lives in completely different directions and helped them to make the world a much better place. A. Liz Murray Liz has shared the stage with world leaders like Mikhail Gorbachev and the Dalai Lama as an international speaker. It's hard to believe that at the age of 16 she was homeless and sleeping on park benches and underground trains. Liz's parents were drug addicts and couldn't look after her and her sister. She says, We ate ice cubes because it felt like eating. We split a tube of toothpaste between us for dinner. When their mother died, their father moved to a homeless shelter, and Liz and her sister were out on the streets of New York. At this point, Liz decided to try to turn her life around. She went back to school, and through dedication and determination, she eventually won a scholarship to a top university. Since Liz graduated from Harvard in 2009, she has been speaking at events to teenagers about staying away from drugs and gangs. She wants them to understand that they can reach their goals, whatever they have had to face in their lives. B. Mark Boyle A few years ago, economics graduate Mark was the manager of an organic food company. He has always been passionate about the environment and social issues, but he felt that he wanted to do even more. He argued that if we grew our own food instead of buying it, we wouldn't throw a third of it away while millions around the world go hungry. So, Mark gave up his job and decided to prove that we don't need money to survive by living without it for a year. He moved into an old camper in the countryside, put in solar panels for power, and started growing his own food and washing in a river. When he didn't have enough homegrown food, he went into the forest to pick wild food like berries. Mark enjoyed the year so much that he has been living without money since then. Recently, he's written a book, The Moneyless Man, A Year of Free Economic Living, and hopes to use the profits to create a whole community that lives without money. C. Narayanan Krishnan Narayanan Krishnan was an award-winning chef who was about to take up a top job in Switzerland. Then, while visiting his parents at home in India, he saw an old man starving under a bridge. He says, I fed that man and decided that this is what I should do for the rest of my life. He gave up his job and set up a charity called the Akshaya Trust. Every day, Narayanan now personally prepares and hands out 400 simple, tasty hot meals to the homeless. He also carries a comb, scissors, and a razor so that he can give haircuts and shaves. Narayanan sleeps in Akshaya's kitchen, but he says he's enjoying his life. He has shown what one person can achieve when they set out to change the world.